Hey guys, Bennett here. And I've got another solo kill on the Ancient Dragons of Destruction. Um, once you get used to these guys with a Gunzerker, they, they become pretty easy. Salvador is pretty overpowered, and you'll see why later in this video. But I'm using the Bitch SMG. It's really accurate, and it's great for picking the dragons out of the sky and bringing them down. Because they land when you shoot them. And then I'm using the Fibber and the Interfacer to do massive critical hit damage. The Fibber, while it's in the left hand, will transfer its 700% critical damage over to the right hand weapon. That makes the Interfacer very deadly. And the Fibber is also slag, so that's helping to also slag the dragons. You can see here Helianth and Brood are taken down very quickly with it. And this here is why I say Salvador is pretty overpowered. You can see Incinerator hits me with a fire dot, drops me below health gate, and then the dot kicks in and kills me. I figured it was over, so I try and land boost for the hell of it and try to get up. And you can see against a full health boost, I was able to get a second wind. Um, boost was kind of victimized there. So I get the fire dragon to land and I go ahead and switch to the unkempt herald and the sheriff's badge because I can't use the fire interfacer against him since he very highly resists fire. Or maybe he's even immune to fire, I'm not sure. And I go ahead and throw some magic missiles to get him slagged up. And I start firing away. Um, I actually muted the audio on this one on accident, so I'm sorry about that ahead of time. I guess it's not really ahead of time now, but... It'd actually be pretty nice to get a shock interfacer for the fire dragon. That'd make this go a little quicker. But it's not important. It's still a fairly easy kill. Usually I bring boost down last, but I used him as a second wind, so incinerator got leveled up, and that didn't really help him too much. Here's my gear, the practicable interfacer in the fire, the fibber for the extra critical damage and slag, the Unkempt Herald was for Incinerator, and the Bitch was to have very accurate firing and to get him to land. Ruby was just for healing, although I didn't really need it. The Blockade Shield, I farmed a very good version. I actually am really starting to like it. Magic Missiles, obviously, for Slag that I didn't use too much. Sheriff's Badge to boost the Herald, and then the Ancient's Relic to boost fire damage to further power the Interfacer, and this awesome Chaotic Monk Evil class mod. Chaotic Evil Monk. It's a great class mod for the Gunzerker. And here's my skill tree that hasn't changed in forever. But I hope you guys enjoyed that and thank you for watching. Also, you can see here that when the dragons spit out their loot, they usually always drop the Seraph item they drop in the same spot. Thanks again, guys. Hope you enjoyed.